Hi guys, my name is Robin. I am Robin Sealing. Thank you so much for subscribing. Thank you for tuning in. I just started doing talks, so I'm not 100% sure on what my topic is even going to be when I tune into these, but I feel guided to coming on. And oddly enough, I, um, I feel like I wanted to talk more about like sexual energy, so very interesting topic. And the word lust is what came up because often we're attracted to people based on um, our feelings. Uh, maybe we're feeling like sexual with towards someone or perhaps we're feeling uh, a little bit shy around someone and it's really Today I just want to talk about the importance of, um, I think, giving in to some of the feelings that we're, that we're feeling. Meaning, um, we get distracted so often by all of these beautiful things and all of these energies that are just pulling us in all these different directions all the time. So I feel like it's about connecting more to... Um, you know, what you want rather than all these energies that are just floating. So it's like often we uh, forget about what we really, really, really want. So it's learning to dismiss um, our attraction that we have to people sometimes. And um, I kind of feel like distraction and attraction get kind of confusing. So let's focus more on the energy of... Um, displacement that's coming up so it's like um we're in an energy right now uh it's currently april 5th 2019 where um we're really focusing on new beginnings so often fertility happens around springtime okay so it's like we're we're feeling extra excited about all these new beautiful things that are blossoming and it just gets us in a different groove and a different funky energy so it's a positive thing but it's really making sure that we're still focusing and putting our energy on things that are actually going to benefit us and that can be kind of confusing during a time like this so it's about making sure that we're always feeling like protected in our in our own energy and when i talk about protection i usually use the word grounding but today i'm going to talk about the energy of like solution so always making sure that you feel like you have solutions to basically everything so you can feel more relaxed and calm and centered if you believe in the power of positivity meaning what you think is what you attract then you're more likely to um, resist these temptations or distractions that are happening in your life when things are trying to uh, pull you in you're just kind of like focusing a little bit more on your self-worth and if you know who you are like if you know your identity then you're more likely to um, not discriminate as well towards people so we will be less likely to uh, react to the energies that are, are around us so as we center and balance and connect more into our groove of things <sighs> We're, our bodies are even going to start to feel more relaxed and more flowy and the energy of resilience is now coming up. So it's about identifying with your ability to um, know when to react and when not to react. So if you are worried about some of the things that you've been doing or you have been struggling with anything, now is the time to really identify with that, all right? So worrying is really important because if we're worrying, we're basically taking positive energy away from ourselves. And when the weather is so beautiful, so again, if you're watching this during April 5th springtime with this new moon in Aries, you're going to be feeling very uplifted and often we get sidetracked as a result. So making sure that you're feeling very centered so that you can balance your energy and really stay in that positive flow. So uh, flow in terms of um, knowing when to resist 
the temptations and the things that we know we don't want to react to and really making sure that we're um, in an energy where we're not questioning ourselves. So being real, earthing, getting outside and just connecting to that universal energy that's abundant. So I guess that's all I needed to say. Namaste. I hope you have a fabulous day. Take care and thanks for watching. Bye.